Hi guys, Tony, the final NBA game of the day for the regular season. The Houston Rockets in the Oklahoma City Thunder. It is going to be the Houston Rockets are going to avenge that loss from February. The Houston Rockets beat them during the Christmas Day game, a recall back during this time, but here's why I'm going to go with the Rockets to win their 54th game to conclude the regular season with 54 games. Now, this is not good at all. So I'm back at the basic calculator. 54 wins is significant in that James Harden and Houston are going to end a period of dominance. And this is a year that mo most, uh, m uh, m most of all, everybody think the Warriors are the unanimous favorite to pretty much sweep the way through the playoffs. James Harden is going to be unleashed. He is a symbolic beast that is going to be unleashed when we talk about the number 666 and 66. Big numbers of the occult because it's mark of the beast that equals 54. But if you wanted to talk about basketball, the Warriors right now have a dynasty in the Western Conference. And that is what Golden State that is what, rather, Houston is trying to end. And the Rockets can win their 23rd game away. And indeed, they've got a king in town. James Harden, two times this year, he scored 61 points. Both Jameses are going to knock off the Warriors in the last five years. King James himself in Cleveland, and then James Harden in Houston. I want you to notice here that if the Rockets win in the first round, they win against OKC, they can end up beating the Denver Nuggets to enter the conference final with uh, 62 wins. I think it's Nikola that equals 62. Nikola Jokic. I think it's Denver Nuggets that equals 62. Indeed, it, it, it is. So it lines up perfectly with 54 wins. The Houston Rockets are going to win the game tomorrow. And, you know, it, it, it all lines up because if the Rockets won 54 games, if they were to win their 12th game to win the Western Conference, that would be 66 total wins. And in Gematria, it is title that equals 66. This is how this is all lining up. For the Houston Rockets to win the title. We talk about the Sixers and Tobias. Well, that equals 66 as well. By the way, when you type in number of the beast in Gematria, the Kabbalic practice of coding letters and words into numbers, number of the beast is 66. That's why 66 is, is really significant to the occult. Uh, the Jedi were extinct. You think about, you know, Revenge of the Sith in Order 66. 66 represents the occult, represents death sacrifice. Many things that the occult truly know what really, 60, uh, know what 66 represents to these people. Oklahoma City, of course, can end up facing the Warriors. That's what might be on the lineup. They can lose their 34th game. Uh, they would then enter... If, if the Thunder were to lose to the Bucks, that would be 35 losses before, before facing off against Kevin Durant. And just simple numerology here is really what I can take away from uh, Oklahoma City without doing much gematria for them. And indeed, that game is going to be over at OKC. That's that's on the road. And there it is. Thank you for watching the NBA Game of the Day coverage. February was really strong. Early March was strong. And then some down periods during March. Some things outside of Gematria that are affecting it. I'll try to stay on schedule much better next year with the picks. And stay away from the cold streaks. That's probably the next thing to go about this next year and I build on the the first part of the playlist. That's what I like to do for next year.